Hi guys, it's Milani here. Welcome to another weekly vlog. This week's vlog is gonna be a little bit different because I'm going on a cruise. Now, I might sound happy when I say that, but I'm actually very, very nervous. I'm happy to be going on a trip. I'm happy that it is a bachelorette function so I get to celebrate something, but I've never been on a cruise, so the nerves. Shop with me and pack with me. Let's go. All right, I made a quick stop at Nick's so hopefully you can hear me with my AirPods in. Also just went to Uniqlo. This is not trip specific, not, well, maybe. So this is one of the most popular items that I've heard of from Uniqlo. Water resistance. It's pretty roomy for a mini bag and the bottom expands. And so I was thinking about taking this on the cruise as like, um, like a beach bag, kind of, when I don't need much. I have to say a pool bag when I'm actually on a cruise ship, when I don't need a lot. Like, since it's water resistant, I was kind of like, kind of wanted to try it out. So I might take this. They didn't have like a white, this is the most neutral color they have, which is like neutral trench coat color. Um, so, and I got a black one too, so we'll see if I take that. I'm just gonna get some lunch right now, and then we'll go to Target. And at Target, I have my little list of what I need to pick up. I will see you guys when we get to Let's get into all the travel stuff that Target has in the bullseye section. This travel pouch would go, I think it clips to your tray on the plane and you can put your phone in if you need to watch stuff and then essentials in here. Travel cup holder, it Velcros to your luggage so you can roll around with it and the two. Cool. Then they have these. So I have a large one of these that I know y'all have seen me use. It has a hook to hang wherever you need it, like in the bathroom, and you can put your toiletries in it. Oh my god. I need everything. This is some of the stuff we got today and some stuff that I got in from Amazon. I'm just covering on my address. But yeah, we got a little, a little haul to go through. Let's do a little Amazon cruise haul. In this package, we have some towel clips so that the wind doesn't blow your beach towel away because it's always annoying like when it doesn't lay flat or just when it doesn't stay over the top. Cruise specific power strip you can't take your regular surge protector from home it has to be a cruise specific one um, there are regulations about it and rules so please look up the specific kind you need for a cruise these are little magnetic hooks apparently the walls in the cruise ship in the room i should say are magnetic hang up a wet swimsuit uh anything really that you need to hang from the wall hats it's just a way to give you more storage and these little magnetic clips, they can hang up to, I think this specific size that I got hang, can hold up to 27 pounds. I want to make sure that I have enough storage for everything that I'm taking. A small electric fan. These are like fanny packs that are waterproof. I got black and gray, but they had a bunch of other colors. It's going to be useful if I go on an excursion or, you know, I'm by the pool and it just clips like a... Like a penny pack. These are my luggage tags, specific cruise luggage tags. So once you print them, you put them in here. There's a zipper on this so that it's protected from like water or anything. And you can identify your bags and they know what boat you're supposed to be on and all that good stuff. And then these are the little loops to hook it on to your luggage. I got a set of disposable bed sheets. I won't explain. Not required, just preference. At this point, I'm taking it all, all around the room. I made this little table and set out some of the things that I knew I was taking. So I might as well just go through the contents. Disinfecting mist from Clorox. I take it to any hotel or room, Airbnb that isn't my own house. I put it in a small bottle like this. A waterproof camera. This is the new one. Oh, this is not the new one. The new one. <laughs> Disinfecting wipes goes without saying. You'll be wiping stuff down. Some sponges. I'm actually going to cut this up and soak it in a little bit of dish soap before I go. People um, had brought their own collapsible cups as I am gonna do. 
also got this from target almost bought it on amazon for like 18 dollars and metal straws because some cruise ships they don't give you plastic straws they give you like a candy straw and i don't want that so i'm gonna have um, the dish soap on the sponges so that i can wash and reuse both my cup and the metal straws that i take I suggested this for a cruise because the bar soap is not super hygienic or antibacterial you don't want to just be rubbing the bar you want some actual soap soap hundreds of people packed on a ship um i just know there are other sicknesses going around too so yeah i'm gonna be washing my hands downy wrinkle release you cannot take an iron or there are no irons on this cruise ship i don't know about all cruise ships but i would assume all cruise ships waterproof pouch if i do an excursion that involves water don't want to get my phone wet even though my phone is um one of the waterproof or water resistant ones if i would hate to have water damage while i'm out the country you know some emergency packets because again stuck with all those people i want to make sure that my immunity is doing okay you know take your portable charger make sure it's actually charged <laughs> cutesy cutesy little thing this is not like a necessity at all but it is a phone umbrella five below for five dollars of course five below has everything that tiktok has just just about um they might just be a few months behind but when it's a sunny out you can still have some shade on your phone and actually see your phone screen liquid iv i have a few packets over there but for me and the girls whoever needs it hydration multiplier it's a little bit salty you can probably see this roll of paper towel it's just for my room as needed water shoes six foot charger book for when i get bored i love this thing it's not anything like revolutionary but it's just like a cool thing to have a document holder okay. tickets passport documents money boarding pass here you at least know where it is and it's not scattered all over the place when it comes to walking around the room this is personal preference but i always take a pair of just regular flip-flops hopefully you found some of that helpful for what you need like specifically for a cruise bring your bottle of wine your best bottle your strongest bottle whatever you want to do and then you can bring um a small pack of cans or cartons of a drink but you cannot bring regular plastic bottled water make sure you check the weather of your port location and your destination like the week before you get there you don't want to be dressing for the wrong type of weather take an umbrella sunscreen never ever ever forget your sunscreen for your body and your face you're supposed to reapply it every two hours do the best you can have chargers for everything too you're gonna have to buy wi-fi packages that's it for my cruise tips for now this might be a little interesting pack we're down to the nitty-gritty it's time to pack and shop our stash and by stash i mean all of my cosmetics, my makeup, my hygiene stuff that's already at home on my shelves. We're gonna go through, pick up what we need, and add it to our handy dandy bag smart toiletry bag. This bag, I've been loving it. I take it on every trip with me now if I'm going to be carrying a lot of like beauty stuff, toiletries, because look at it. It's got a hook on it. And so when you're in the bathroom or wherever getting ready, um, everything is open for you this is always in my amazon storefront and yeah we're about to fill this bad boy up so let's get shopping
some of the makeup has been packed for like a week now everything that's sitting in this bin so i'm not gonna pull it all out instead you'll just have to stay tuned for the looks when i get ready with you this is one of the first times i decided to use packing clips what packing cubes in order to organize all of my clothing and i really actually wasn't even organizing it or dividing it any certain way just whatever would fit in one and i usually do my underwear in like a separate one now what i will say is that um i overpacked uh, i was trying to compensate for all of the themes that she had planned for us and you know any inclement weather but my suitcase was overweight i got the weight down but still gave myself a bigger suitcase to fit the things better i was kind of embarrassed because everybody else had like a carry-on size luggage but it worked out in the end the full bachelorette trip video is on the way let me know if you guys want that i hope this video was helpful to you please let me know in the comments if you liked any of these tips and thank you so much for watching